today I'm going to be doing a review on a new product from Kosas Cosmetics and the name of it is the Kosas Super Creamy, sorry, Kosas Super Creamy Brightening Concealer and this is what it looks like so you guys can see. This is the packaging and this is the product. I don't, now to tell you guys, I'm gonna I wrote some notes down so I can make sure I give you guys as much information as possible about this product and I will tell you how I feel about this product and um, I did like light makeup and but I didn't add any concealer because I want to do a demonstration of how this product works so you can actually see um, how it works and what difference it makes and how uh, natural it looks. So to tell you guys a little bit about the Kosas um, Super Creamy Concealer. All right, so I'm going through my notes. So one, this is twenty eight dollars. So it's it is a little bit pricey for a concealer, but you guys have to remember that this is a hundred percent organic, clean, natural product. All right, the brand is 100% natural, and whenever you're paying for something natural, it's going to cost you a little bit more. It's 100% vegan, cruelty-free, gluten-free, and alcohol-free. It comes in 18 shades, so you will find your match. It comes in seven deep shades for women of color. Can I repeat that again? Seven deep shades for women of color. Okay, this is a company that is thinking about women of color all right also thinking about women who have very very fair fair light skin as well um the coverage is medium to full coverage it's a creamy concealer um it doesn't have it has a, a basically a radiant natural finish um it's not matte at all it's just natural and it's it's i love it it has a natural finish. I'm not a huge fan of mattes. I'm not a huge fan. Sometimes I do the matte look, but I'm more of a like dewy, natural, glowy skin kind of person. So that's one more what I look for. And um, this is one of the reasons why I love this product. Um, it's for all skin types, dry, mature, sensitive, sens sensitive, blemish prone, combination, and normal. Okay. It's a concealer and it's also a skincare treatment so it's a, it's a concealer and skincare treatment as well okay so it helps with um sp like spots it helps with dry uh dark circles um it hydrates the skin it improves your complexion by fighting dark circles and blemishes um it has caffeine in it to brighten under uh the eyes it, ha it has hyaluronic acid. You guys know what that does to the skin. It really hydrates and soothes the skin. It has pink algae. It has natural botanicals. And um, it's, it has like, um, I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, uh, peptides, which support natural collagen. All right. So it naturally helps plump the skin as well. And um, yeah. So the only thing is that... Uh, it's $28, but I swear to you, it's 100% worth it. It's worth it, okay? Um, so, yeah, I'm going to show you how I apply this. Let me just reach in here real quick and get my stuff. So, I, on purpose, didn't apply anything underneath my eyes because I wanted to show you guys on camera, all right? So, very easy to access. It has... Um, a nice applicator so I'm gonna apply it to my skin and show you how I use this all right so um, do three little dots like that a little bit goes a long ways um, the thing I like about this too it it really blends into the skin really nice so first I use my fingers first I use my fingers and I just lightly dab it into the, the eye area and it has a nice cooling feel to it when you apply it. Oh my gosh, it's so light. It is super light and it blends really nice. Now, I used to use the Bobbi Brown Creamy Concealer. That used to be my favorite. This kind of reminds me of it, but this concealer is a lot different. 
um before they even made this concealer on social media the brand reached out and they asked people their customers what do you want in a concealer what do you love in a concealer what do you want your concealer to do and honestly i'm just going to be honest with you guys this is that's it that's it right now Ever since I switched over to Clean Beauty, I searched and searched and searched for a concealer that I would fall in love with. The RMS is one of my favorite. I tend to use that a lot. But now that this came out, this is my number one go-to concealer. I should have got like three of them. <laughs> it will last a long time, but this is my number one favorite concealer of all time. I think so. So I'm just going to blend it in with my fingers. And it's so natural. Look at this. Look. And look how it brightens underneath my eyes. The shade that I have is uh, 8.2. So 8.2 is the shade that I have. And I always go for um, a shade a little bit lighter than my skin tone because I only, personally, I only use concealer to brighten up underneath my eyes. And look at that. Now, this is just the concealer by itself. After I use my fingers, I take a sponge and I just blend it in a little bit more. And I just want to show you guys how natural it looks. And how it blends into my skin and how it brightens underneath my eyes. Like I said, when you apply it, you feel like a nice cooling sensation. Because it's not only a concealer, it's a skin treatment as well. And I love this. I have been using this for a week and a half or almost two weeks now. I didn't. I wanted to use it for some time so I can um, really give my honest opinion and um, let you guys know if it works for me. This concealer is amazing. I love it and it's my favorite. It's my favorite concealer in the clean beauty world. The second, my second favorite concealer in the clean beauty world would be the RMS um, cream, the RMS concealer. But this is my number one favorite, and um, it's ama it's amazing. I love it. Um, it's most definitely my go-to. Now, now I can wear it like this, and I'm perfectly fine, you know. But if you want, um, it, it pretty much lasts all day. But if you want to add a little bit of powder, you can. So. Um, I'm using the Lori, the Lori Mercier powder, and I'm just going to add a little bit, just a little bit on top. And I do this sometimes just to make it last just a little bit longer. And sometimes I just like the way, I just like the way it looks. It does, you know, matt it out a little bit if you want that look. And since I didn't really do my makeup today, I'm just going to add a little bit on my forehead for I get a little shiny. And there you go. Look how pretty it looks. So I'm just going to just do like a few poses just so you guys can see this concealer and how amazing it is all right i'm using natural light so you guys can actually see what this concealer like how this concealer looks on my skin for my sisters out there this is a great concealer and they have a lot of shades they have 18 shades so if you are someone who has problems because you're like too pink too too fair too dark and you can't find a concealer that works for you this concealer is going to work for you it feels amazing on the skin look look how natural it looks on my skin and how it just one it just brightens up it brightens up my eyes i love it so i just wanted to share this uh uh review with you guys i wanted to demonstrate it i wanted to put it on my skin so you can see how it works um the closest creamy concealer it's uh 28 you can get this from sephora and you can, I think you can also get this from Credo Beauty as well. All right. So let me just show you guys one thing again. One more time. Guys, I have to get a new camera. So I, I do apologize if any of my videos have been a little bit blurry or just not uh, focused. I have to get a new camera. My camera is old. And you guys know cameras cost a lot of money. So um, anyway, I hope you guys like the video. I hope you guys like my review. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you have any questions, let me know. 
and one more look at this concealer and again this is shade 8.2 all right okay guys bye